Evan Nelson and the Crimson with the game's first possession. Number four, Chris Ludlow, who's put up the best offensive numbers this year for them to Justice Ajabor. And on the first possession, the Crimson convert. Wilson getting the defensive assignment initially, and there they find Sam Silverstein on the backdoor cut. Again, they'll use a lot of the shot clock and spread the floor. They play four around one. Lindlam trying to split Wilson and Adams and turns it over. Harrison transition score. Ajabor on Adams turns over that shoulder off the left side, deflected out, and here comes Harris on the run. He's got Wilson with him, bounces it to him, and he lays it in. Dewan Harris has been spectacular. Ultimate team leader in Dewan Harris. Take a look, transition. He has got eyes everywhere. Run the floor, and you'll get it. Here's Edgefor coming off a career high eight points last Saturday against Indiana. Wilson just hesitated and then got around to Opar and he has eight points. Yeah. He'll reconvene a couple of days after Christmas. And the same for the KU players. They'll be able to disperse, spend Christmas with their families. And Silverstein throws it into the chest of Edgefor. Harvard so far has played very efficient basketball. KJ Allen strong to the rim. I don't know if you would have seen that move from KJ Adams that long. Look who's back in the game, by the way. That is interesting, and he's guarding Ledlam. Ajabor trying to spin past Adams. KJ got a hand up and a rebound, or actually taken away by McCullough. Jayhawks, who are averaging 37 percent three-point shooting, 0 for 7 to start the game, and Wilson has hit a pair for Harvard. Nelson. No, I, I think the game plan has been pretty good by Harvard. They're just daring Kansas to shoot. Nice tip. McCuller sticking with it. Gain a head of steam and drive on you, and he not only can do that, he's got the confidence to do it. Below his chest. This is why we watch this release. Boom, right up. Catch and shoot. Averaging 16 points per game, second on the team behind Jalen Wilson. Again, zone defense here. Be careful if you're Harvard. Something good is coming. And only a couple of second differential. Shot clock, game clock. I think I think you got to give Ledlam room to skin dribble. He cannot dribble into traffic. Knocks down a three. There's the first one. Watch Ledlam. Clock running down. Pretty smooth. Kansas does have a chance to get the final shot here. It's in the hands of Grady Dick. It's on the way. You just don't leave Grady Dick open once he, once he crosses midcourt. That rhythm shot from third. They lost their composure the last four minutes and allowed Kansas to get on that big run. And it's 16 to three run the last five minutes and turn it over on their first possession. Part the of they stopped moving the ball side to side. Early in the game, they made Kansas defend all 50 feet. They're not doing that right now. Adams in the lane. And by the way, when you watch it, it's because Kansas is starting to really, really defend. Crimson just two of their last 14 from the field, and there's a highly makeable shot in this flush there by Ajibor. With the last seven minutes and 45 seconds of the first half without committing foul. That's an important three for Evan Nelson. Ajabor. Ledlam fakes the three, sees an open lane, and has a chance for the three-point play. Kick it out. Look at that pass. Look at the lane. Shot fine, shot fake. And you see Ledlam's athleticism. Turning it over a couple of times early in the half. He started to get things to click more offensively here. Harris sees nice. an open lane. Yep. Pretty. Harvard came out, took a nine-point deficit at the half, cut it to three, and Ajabor the block, but Adams is right there to answer for KU. You'll we'll see him get downhill and make plays here. Going to have to make something happen quickly. Down to three, down to two, and has it stolen away by Grady Dick. McCullers spinning, turning, scoring. Nice. Absolutely. Charlie Baker, the new uh, president of the NCAA, who's the governor of Massachusetts. Big shot right by their silver. Watch this ball screen right now. And the lob. Uday is in there as Harris tried to get the ball to earn his due day. Stolen. Silverstein. Awkward position there. 
Off the hands of Ledlam. He gets it right back. Five to shoot. Probably has to pull a three here. Puts yep. it up, and I think MJ Rice got a hand on that. He, he did knew it. it. Never got it to the rim. Wilson 0 for 5 from beyond the arc tonight. Fires underneath. Akpara able to finish it off. Yeah, that was seven years ago. This is that was the only meeting between these two schools. This is meeting number two, Wilson. And the same for the Harvard guys. They're flying back to Boston yep. tomorrow. Down to five on the shot clock. Flipped it up and got it. Three point opportunity for your athlete. And you know, to start the second half, they did a really good job of going inside. And there you see Rice reaching in. Great over the top pass inside by Akpara. I've already got commitments in the class of 24. Robert Hitch from Harvard Westlake is an excellent player. Nice tip. Oh, I thought Grady Dick got that to go. Gray two resets it up for the Crimson. Only down four here about midway through the second half. Gray two getting to the rim, but there he is stopped by Zach Clements. Watch this right here. Now this, you're going to come all the way up to court, and I hope we get a chance to see you. He's going to miss the shot. And then watch him sneak in. <laughs> and then you get it to Grady Dick. It's over, buddy. Going right. Harris. Oh, they've got somebody out in front. Here goes Harris again, and that's money. I just don't think he's underrated anymore. From the right elbow, Ludlam answering for the Crimson timeout, Harvard. Pettiford in the game now as Harris has come out. Bobby getting towards nice. the rim. Yep. There's Silverstein again. We talked about the dirty work. Let alone with the three. They keep hanging around. Watch the post up right here. Try to get McCullough. Here you go. He's going to go to work. Faces up on Lendlum. Spins. What yep. a move there. Oh, yeah. Kevin McCullough. They did away with the two game, that high low game years ago with those two big guys, but they always have that in their back pocket. Opara bounce nice pass. Cut. Silverstein reverses and lays it in. And is playing with Pettiford and Harris on the floor at the same time. Wilson along two. Adams blocked by Ajibor. Ajibor, I said it, he's a high major athlete. Sakota gives it up. Silverstein, Lendlum from behind, Wilson. And Ludlum's looking around like, what happened there? There's a great cut, and let's watch. There's no foul. Great defense. It's now a double-double for Kevin McCuller. Timeout. Crimson. Possession of the game for Harvard if they're going to stick around. That last timeout was their last for the Crimson. Nelson, they need a bucket, and they get one. He's been impressed. Pettiford underneath. Adams. Ajapur there to reject it. Lendlam trying to get it to the rim. Got it to go in and one. Take a look. Little luck? Yeah, probably. But he's from Brooklyn. Again, Kansas, nothing from the perimeter. Three for 17. Harris in and out tip and Jalen Wilson with that tip Wilson's thousand point take a look right here Harris baited into shooting and that is basket interference don't see Grady Dick miss that pass over the top Ajabor let him one dribble oh what a block by McCullough that's the second time tonight let thought he had an easy layup watch this play right here I'm a, well, that's a long rebound, and it's run out by Wilson. He's got Adams ahead, along with Dewan Harris. Back to Jalen. Second try. Nice. Yep. There's points 1,001 and two. Certainly in the Big 12. See too much one on one by Harvard right now. But they'll take that. Sakota has, has played really well here in a tough place. Wide open three. Arizona State made the top 25 this week and got beat by 40. Pretty good effort by Harvard, but Kansas. It's Kansas. 
68-54, Kansas. What's Bill Self going to think about his team after this game now heading into that Christmas break? It'll be absolutely fine. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.